was another sunny day in Thailand with, you know, everyone busy with their usual routine. And uh, my friends and I decided to hit the road for, you know, for a little adventure. Little did we know this adventure was going to cost us a little over 1,500 Thai baht. So we got pulled over by the police and um, I wasn't too surprised because I'd always seen this coming. Like ever since I went to Thailand, I started driving, I started riding without alliances. I knew eventually the police was going to stop me. My passport? Yeah, 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 you can, you pay fine. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So at this point, my passport has been taken from me and I was given this little uh, piece of paper to go meet some other officers under this tent um, where there were other people over there um, who probably did not have licenses or their, um, you know, vehicles or motorcycles were not registered. So we find a lot of um, um, foreigners over there. Most of them were foreigners. And, um, yeah, so you can see we are in a queue. So we're asked to sign uh, a bond of good conduct that um, next time when they catch us on the road, we would have a driver's license. So that is what we were asked to do over there. And my guy had to sign, even though he was a local. to look for so we have to look for atm now easy easy ah oh, amanda is gonna kill me Inaina. Oh. so this is my first time i've been stopped by the police they said i do not have a license which yeah that's true of course i do not have a license and i'm riding been driving as well so i got a ticket that's 1000 baht um it's okay, we're gonna pay so we can proceed to um, wherever we're going to. You know, they took my passport, the keys to the uh, motorbike is still there. ATM, you know. So, my guy also was stopped because he also did not have the license. So, I think for Thai nationals, it's just 500 baht, and then for international tourists or whatever, we have to pay 1000. So I'm here at the ATM now. Yeah. Oh, story of my life. Um, I forgot my ATM card at home. I don't know how I'm going to get money, but luckily, my friend has cash on him. So he's going to settle me. Oh my goodness, Thailand. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm going to chuck you, baby. Yeah, yeah. Thousand, thousand. Okay. One for you, one for me. Okay. Yeah. But no, I have you. So we went back to the tent to do the payment because, mind you, without the payment, we do not get our passports, neither do we get the keys to the motorbike. So, you know, we had to proceed to um, do the payment and then also to sign that. Um, piece of paper so yeah we went ahead did the signing took some time because it was like seven officers had to go through it so as soon as they were done yeah we were able to leave and then that was it yeah okay okay No, we can tell you. You drive on the bike around the camp. Put it check the camp, too. Okay. It's no bad. Thank you so much. I just ran out of it. So funny thing, we were given another piece of paper. We were asked to show it to any other police whenever uh, we get pulled over by another police by the roadside. So this is how it's going to be like. If another police stops me and asks for my license, I just need to show this paper to him and we'll be good. Now, let me know your thoughts. What do you think? Because if this were to be some other countries, you'll be detained. Maybe the police might arrest you or something like that. But in this case, they just um, stop you. 
get your money, give you another piece of paper. Then they're like, okay, continue. Let me know what you think. And um, don't forget to subscribe. My name is Malik Sterling. Like this video and share. Thank you.